but here you get one fish man it's gonna be big like wait till the sun comes up you truly understand you when these they, oh i had another bike oh i got a big fish i got a really big fish oh my god i got a really big fish everyone welcome back hope you have an amazing day so today we're back on the Trout River as you guys can see uh, the water is actually pretty clear the wind is a little from the east and it's uh like an overcast day partly cloudy it's starting off a little clear and sunny and then uh, they're calling for a storm later so I'll try to get as much fishing as I can uh, lately I haven't been fishing that much because uh, I had some family celebrations I had to celebrate my own birthday which is pretty cool thank you everybody for wishing me a birthday sorry about the traffic right now uh, i'm on riverside drive just walking out here just getting ready to go so first off i'm going to be jigging a tube today and i'm going to use a three quarter ounce jig with a three and a half tube i usually get them by lunker hunt uh there's all different other brands that work really well but i like the lunker hunt ones i like using the pumpkin Anything that's like a natural color, the grays, the browns, the oranges, something that mimics like a goby or a crayfish, and that is my best, best bet. So what I usually do is I take that three quarter ounce jig and I slip it into the tube. And then I pop the nose out and I tie it on. Well, we'll show you that in the video in a second. Uh, today I'm going to be fishing very, very hard. I'm going to try to catch as many fish as I can. It doesn't matter what bites, I'm going to try to catch them all. Hopefully I catch a couple smallmouths. Uh, I'm looking for the odd walleye and maybe, yeah, I'm probably going to catch a lot of sheephead, but I'm going to be out there and I'm going to meet up with Tan and my brother and Troy and all of them guys. Anyways, guys, stay tuned. Let's get to fishing. Let's go. Okay. So, so, as you guys can see here, I got a selection of baits here. So, there's three colors that I keep with me at all times the sand the chartreuse and then almost like a black <clears throat> with the red glitter in it and I always carry a three quarter ounce tube jig right there this is the key right here to the Detroit River a three quarter ounce tube jig you want the long one long version I could get these from uh, Strictly's which is 3402 Sandwich Street West uh, go in there, ask for Chuck, tell him Buck sent you, and he will give you these right here. These are just amazing. They really re work really well. You can sink it to the bottom. Uh, can't. There's no complaints about them. Just bounce the bottom, you get the fish. All right. So I got one of my favorite color tubes here, which is like a pumpkin, three and a half inch here, and then I got my jig. And I'm gonna slip this jig right here into this tube. So they got an opening at the bottom here, as you guys can see. Right there, I'm gonna slip it all the way up. Now you wanna try to get it so the bar, yeah, as you see it travels up. So you want the whole thing in there, right to the top. And once you have it to the top like that, you see this little nub here? You want to push that through. So, once you push that through right there, see that? Now you should be able to tie your line through. So let's tie it to our line now. So as you guys see, right here, I got my barrel swivel to my leader line. 20 pound braid so right here 20 pound braid the red line then I got 20 pound four carbon leader then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tie the jig on so I'm gonna slip it through that hole so now guys got that tied on so I got my tube Add on to my leader line right here. See a barrel swivel right there, the tube, and then my barrel swivel 
tie it on to my braid and that's all you need now all you gotta do is watch the jigging tutorial for walleye and use the same technique and it works enjoy guys let's go fishing it's a walleye trust me it's a walleye walleye it is i believe it see i told you the walleye goes right off the bat right hand yeah right off the bat mr walleye see Dude. see who needs a boat who needs a boat let me see this yeah <laughs> year 10 Woo. Woo. but here you get one fish man it's gonna be big like wait till the sun comes up you truly understand you when these they're oh i had another bike oh i got a big fish i got a really big fish oh my god Oh my god! I got a really big fish. Woo! Oh, wow! Here we go, guys. Another fish. Oh man. This might be a smallie. Bro. Yeah. Or a sheep. No, I think it's a sheep head. Never mind. It's a sheep head. I know. Holy cow, man. Oh. No, it's a sheep head. It's like it's a, it's like a 10 pound sheep head. Holy cow. It might be a wild star, Troy. There's lots of fish here. The fish just jumped out there. There's another one. Might be a wild. <laughs> Here she comes, she's coming in, she's getting tired. I don't know what it is, man. It's a big fish though. It's really big. Probably a sheep head. Yeah, it's gonna be a sheep head. Just by the way it's fighting. Oh she's coming up. She's getting tired. Oh. The last couple tugs here. Do we have color yet? We have color? She's almost straight up under it. Oh yeah, it's a sheep head. Big old drum. There we go. It's a gray bass. Yeah, super, super fight. Thank you, Troy. Woo! Another fish. Look at the size of that thing. What did they say last time? Make shoop. Make shoop. <laughs> Make shoop. <laughs> yeah. Oh. There you go, guys. Giant freshwater drum. Woo! Yeah. Hey, this is still fun, though. Luck bass. Damn. Woo! Bro. That's huge, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah. There we go. That's what I'm talking about, Jay. Probably gonna be a smallie. I think it's a, it's a smallie. And I think it's a smallmouth. It is. Oh, nice jump. Oh, yeah. nice fish. There you go, Jay. Nice size, eh? Yeah. It matches the color of your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> nice fish, bro. That's awesome, man. Oh, yeah. I want to see that thing. 10 pounds. I don't know about 10 pounds, but. Still be no. Not even. I got a scale here. That's like one. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, baby. That's like one. You gotta hold it right in front of the camera, make it look like it's bigger than you. Yeah. <laughs> That's a nice fish. <laughs> Holy fuck! There we go. Nice catch, Jay. The little guy. Oh, well, it was beautiful. It was the anus uh, <laughs> Ta-da! And back it goes. There you go, bro. Hope he's still alive, too. Or looks like it. Oh. Not enough room. Watch it. Watch it. It worked. <laughs> That's 
impressive. There we go. Yeah, that thing's big. Yeah. Damn. Grasshopper. <laughs> Young grasshopper. I thought a grasshopper. What are you guys using? Shrimp? Oh, you guys are about to get some nice big catfish probably. Oh yeah. There we go, fish on. Fish on guys. Give me a small one, small small mouth. Real quick. Oh, I can fling this up. All right, there you go guys. On that same tube, not even a couple of minutes. There you go. Nice little beauty fish here. Back into the river she goes. This is gonna be a long one. It's a big one. I'm gonna horse it in. Are you sure? That's a sheep head. Yeah. That's a sheep head. No, that's a sheep head. It's just a medium sheep head. So it's aggressive. Well, look at all the minnows. Oh, it's a drum. She's tired. There you go, another fish. That's a big one. Make shoot! Like 10 pounds? Easily. Look at the gold on the belly. Hey? See that it's right there? Big. That's huge. Let's make shoot. <laughs> big fish. You want it? Yeah, I, 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 I want to go for my pet. Okay. Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe she I don't know. No, 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 she no. No, not she
Oh, very bad. Guys, hmm. the store is on a scale. Maybe three and a half, huh? I don't know, maybe. Yeah. We'll find out. We'll find out. Oh! Hold on, hold on, wait till I stay still. Three pounds, oh! Three pounds, 11 ounces, I know that. Alright guys, check that out. Three pounds, 11 ounces. Nice big fat chunker. Huge right there. I'm about to let this baby go. Okay. Huh? Yes. I don't eat that one. You don't know what? No. Why does that me? Huh? I, I, I only catch and release bass. Alright guys, gonna end my day there. That's how you rig a tube for the Detroit River. Uh, if you go with that style right there. You end up catching a lot of smallmouth during the great season, which is like usually beginning of July. But now we're into August, not so many fish. So we ended up catching a couple smallmouth there, a couple sheephead. Uh, it was a tough bite, but we still managed to catch a lot of fish. Anyways, guys, until next time. Actually, you know what? Here is some uh, <coughs> bonus footage that we had for our previous outings. Uh, I. I didn't get to put them on from our previous outings, so it was missed. I found some, kept some, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So until next time, signing off. It's a, it's a fish. Oh, 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 oh. It's a fish. <laughs> it is a... Uh... What is that? That's a bowfin or a snakehead or something. I don't know. What is that? That's a bowfin. Okay. Those, those dogfish or something. Are they, uh, yeah, it is. Bullfin. That's my first one ever. Look at the mouth. It's blue on the inside. Holy smokes. Wow, look at that, T. That's That's crazy. Man, the the it's got blue inside the mouth here. But I, I, I can't open it because uh, it's got some teeth. <laughs> so check that out. First fish on the day, bro. Beautiful. Ta da! <laughs>